Hey guys, today I'm going to be building an egg tumbler. It's going to go in my aquarium. It's going to um, tumble my tilapia eggs. i um been looking online and some of the other builds, and uh, this seems to be pretty popular, pretty effective. This basically is just a fluorescent light tube protector. This one's about 48 inches long, but I'm going to make it a 8 inches. going to cut this thing. And this will be my main piece of the tumbler. Uh, basically, I have a coupling that's just going to fit in here at the very bottom. There'll be a piece of mesh wedged in. Um, I'll explain all the pieces in general here in a moment how they work. But basically, it's not very much. Like I said, you just need the protector for the main body tube of the egg tumbler. The suction cup is going to attach it to the glass. Uh, top piece is the elbow. And uh, the bottom coupler will... We'll create the top and bottom. Of course, be mesh in between. Air stone will go down through here. So, what I've done is I've measured eight inches down <clears throat> to get me a mark here, and I used a piece of paper that comes inside the protector to line it up with my mark to help me, you know, make a straight cut there. So I'll get that cut made, and we'll go on to the next step here. Okay, guys, I got that cut made. Next thing I've done is take one of these couplers like so. And I put a piece of mesh over the top of the coupler. And then I force the tube down over top of it. Just like so. There's the mesh screen inside there. You got the tube pushed down on it, as you can see down through there. The eggs will sit on the bottom of that mesh there at this level. And they'll sit there and tumble back and forth. The water will come in through the bottom and lift them. Uh, next thing is I'm going to go ahead and get the top ready. Here I have my elbow marked. I'm going to put a hole at the very top of this elbow. Airline is going to come down through the top of this elbow and uh, have you an air stone or just a, the actual open airline itself. Um, you can go through this side. I thought about it actually too. You can just run the airline in through here at the top down into the tumbler. The only reason why I've decided not to do that is because I won't be able to have any tension. Like if I wanted to say, so like it's not tumbling enough, I need to go down with it. Well, slack on the on the actual line could pull it back out of there. I want it to go through and be able to control the depth of the height. And by having a hole at the top, just the size of the airline, it'll stay put wherever I place it. Um, and also to give you an idea what, how this is going to function, you're going to have your, uh, see here's a whole piece right here as you can see. Um, that airline is going to come into the top, okay? It's going to blow bubbles, blow air back out of the top. That will create a suction that will force water in through the bottom to feed, you know, through the top. So, and that's what will create the tumbling action here on the bottom of the screen and allow these eggs to tumble. Now, of course, if they're tumbling too rapid, too much, too fast, you'll take the airline and pull, pull up, you know, get it up out of there a little farther away. And, um... That's the reason for having the hole to, you know, make sure that you can create the distance that your airline needs to be inside. You know, if it need, it's not tumbling enough, of course, then you can go down with it. And, of course, it's going to stay put on this hole. So, I'm going to go ahead and get that hole put through there and uh, move on to the next step. Okay. Went ahead and made that hole in the top of this elbow. Made my mark. Put the hole straight down through the center of the elbow. Of course, that'll go on the top of this tumbler. Took the dimension of this overall piece, which I made it eight inches, went right dead center to help balance the weight. Put me a hole, added my suction cup, right snaps right in the side there, and uh, added a zip tie at the very bottom of the tumbler to lock this in. Um, and actually, what's going to happen? The the top piece, the elbow, will be coming on and off. So I actually zip tie the cloth mesh to the elbow at the top so that it'll stay on here um, and I uh, go from there so I'll go ahead and get that done and uh, finish up with this and let you see it okay guys here it is this is a finished product got an 8 inch tube here a coupler on the bottom with the mesh zip tied on suction cup in the center elbow at the top got the hole in the top for the airline to go in hole being in the elbow which would restrict it a little bit as far as being able to adjust the position where the 
the airline will start or stop controlling the difference in the tumbling action with the eggs. And I got a mesh to outlet on the very top so that no none could escape if they start, to, you know, if they got to tumbling too fast and push some eggs out, they could flush them right out into the tank. So that's what that's for. And um, we'll get this inside and uh, get some eggs in it. And thanks for watching. I hope this helped you, give you some ideas. And um, until next time, I'll see you later. Subtract the light, subtract the heart, add in the pain, put me in the dark. Yeah, now give me a couple problems, add in a pad and a pen, so I can solve them.